Hello everybody, I hope you're all doing well and keeping safe. Now in this video I'm going to be showing you how to create this gorgeous bouncy wave hair look. So if you would like to see how I create this using the Dyson Airwrap Kit, then please keep watching. The first step to this style is beginning with wet hair. I have just come out the shower and washed my hair. We are then going to want to prep the hair because prepping the hair is the most important step. I'm going to be using two Jerome Russell products. I love this brand. They are vegan and cruelty free, of course. And the two products I'm going to be using is the Blow Dry Balm. This is a heat protection and it actually protects up to 230 degrees. Although the Dyson Airwrap is really good for preventing heat damage, I still like to use this just in case because it's always good to protect the hair. Also it leaves my hair feeling really nice and gives a good smell so I enjoy it for those reasons too. The next product I'm going to be using is the Jerome Russell Smoothing Spray. I love this because it controls any flyaways you may have with your hair which is fantastic when you're drying it and styling it because you want it to look as smooth and silky as possible so I love these as a duo they're so good and we're gonna be popping those on now My so eco detangling brush I just like to quickly brush all the product through so I have an even distribution so I know that my hair is a hundred percent prepped and ready to go so now is the part that we've all been waiting for and it is the dun dun dun, dun. Dyson kit oh my goodness this is my baby, this is my child. I am so in love with this kit. Honestly, it's so amazing and I highly recommend. I was very lucky to receive this for a Christmas present by my lovely boyfriend and I have enjoyed creating so many different hair looks with this kit. Although I know it is more on the higher end of the price range of hair dryers, but honestly, once you go Dyson, you will never want to go back. Honestly, these products are so amazing and I'm going to show you how amazing they are in this video. For today's look, I'm going to be using two different attachments. The first attachment is the actual hair dryer attachment. This is to get our hair damp, not fully dry, because that is what we're going to be using the second attachment for, and that is the smallest barrel. This creates the cutest curls, and I absolutely love the look that we will be finishing with. I'm now going to be using the hair dryer attachment first and clipping it in. This is so easy to do, honestly, it was that easy. And I like to use the hottest setting to dry my hair and the most amount of air pressure to so the top one there. I'm going to dry my hair until it is slightly damp and then we will move on to the curling part but for now let's dry the hair. Before we begin with the air up I like to just give my hair a quick brush through just to get rid of any knots that we may have created when drying our hair. Now that our hair is nice and not free, I like to take the top section up of my hair and clip it up so we can start to air wrap our hair in layers. It just makes the process a lot easier and you get those really nice and defined curls. Now the air wrap is super easy to use. It literally does all the work for you. All you need to do is take a small section of hair and get the air wrap and pop it towards the end tips of your hair. The air wrap will then suck the hair in and start to curl it. What I like to do is once all the hair is up and into the air wrap, I like to hold the hair there for about 10 seconds and then put onto a cool setting so that the curl can set and then slowly release. This should produce the cutest little curl. All you want to do is now continue this technique all the way around your hair so you can produce nice curls all around the bottom section of your hair. So I'm now taking down the top section and I'm just going to repeat what we did before but on the top section is so easy to do honestly if you can see the hair literally just gets sucked up inside, dried and comes out curly. It's literally 
the best thing I have ever used and saved so much time. Let's crack on and do the top half of our hair. The front part of my hair always dries a lot quicker so I quickly went off camera and just put a little bit of water on my fringe part so I can crack on and start curling the fronts of my hair and then I will finish off the rest of my hair and come back to you when the hair is finished. Now that all the curls are done, I am going to brush this side out because as you can see, they're quite tight curls and I like a more like kind of brushed out look. So I'm just gonna grab my Soeco brush again and just brush through the curls like so. And oh, this look is so nice. And guys, that is the finished look. How gorgeous and easy was that to create? I am so obsessed with this look. I feel like it has such a retro -y vibe. I live for the fringe. I feel like I'm going to the disco. Honey, this look is everything. I just feel so glam, but it was so easy to do. I'm literally living my hair fantasy. I am obsessed. This look was so easy to create and I hope my instructions were easy to follow but if you do have the Dyson Air Wrap then you do know how easy these kind of looks are to create. Although I know it is a little bit more on the pricey side of hair tools but honestly once you have a kit you literally have everything you could ever need in there and you can create looks like this. Highly recommend a Dyson Air Wrap kit you can't go wrong. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video and that my instructions were easy to follow. If you do recreate this look, then please don't forget to tag me on Instagram with your looks. I would love to see how you get on. Honestly, this is so easy to create and anyone could do it. So I would love to see if any of you do recreate this. But for now guys, please don't forget to give the video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that post notification bell. But until the next time guys, stay safe and I will see you very soon. Bye guys.